The theodolite can also be used to calculate the height as also the reduced level of objects when those values cannot be measured with the dumpy level. This method of measurement is called measuring the height base accessible. Let's take a look at the steps to be followed in this method. First, set the theodolite at the station and level the instrument. After that, make the line of collimation horizontal. Keep the vertical circle to the left side and adjust the vernier so that its zero mark coincides with the zero of the vertical circle. Then, swing the telescope and take the staff reading over the given benchmark. This reading gives you the height of the instrument. Now, swing the telescope towards the object. Undo the vertical clamp screw, sight the top of the object and then fix the vertical clamp screw. Make a note of the readings of the C and D verniers. Then, take the measurement of the distance between the instrument station and the base of the object. Change the face of the instrument to face right and repeat the procedure. Calculate the mean of both the readings. Calculate the average of the two mean readings. You will obtain theta, the angle of elevation. As you know both the distance from the object to the instrument and the angle of elevation, you can now calculate the height of the object with the formula h is equal to d tan theta. You can calculate the reduced level with the formula reduced level is equal to height of benchmark plus height of instrument plus height of object. So, remember, these are the steps to be followed for measuring the height base accessible with the theodolite.